So, uh, yo. So, I've made a pretty big discovery on something that could change Funky Friday possibly forever. And it is Reshade's motion blur. So, you probably know that Reshade is a software to make your game look hyper realistic. Like, you know, all the ar other Arsenal YouTubers that make their game look like RTX on and things. They use a bunch of effects, motion blur. Today I decided that I wanted to try... I didn't want to try the RTX settings for Funky Friday, but I decided that I wanted to try motion blur and see what it would look like. Turns out it actually made the game better. So we're going to be comparing the two... Uh, what it looks like without motion blur and what it looks like with motion blur. And you're going to see a very big and significant difference to say the least and i will be making a tutorial on this on how to get these uh this motion blur setting it's very easy to get and i'll be just showing you after it's very easy trust me i'll be including it in the video Without motion blur.
with motion blur. Now we're going to be talking about the difference between both of the uh, clips I showed you. You probably didn't realize what differences were there, but I'm going to explain to you what the differences are. So we're going to be starting with no motion blur. This is my video of me using no motion blur as you can see. This is regular vanilla Roblox, no modifications at all. And we're going to be seeing what's the difference. So as you can see, right off the bat, there is, the arrows are like, you could say choppy. They instantly come in one animation. They, uh, they do, there isn't really a difference. It will differ on what screen you use, of course. But as you can see, this is basically just normal. But what's interesting is that it's one frame. While if we look at the motion blur, if we look at the motion blur, as you can see, it is not one frame. Because look, as you can see here, it's just one frame. Maybe there's going to be like a couple of other frames. While this, it contains more individual bits of frames and actually also blur the uh, arrows as well. I also, I also want to talk about the animations because there's also a difference with the animations because as you can see, this is much more smooth. So motion blur basically, it's used to make things more smoother. Like we can also talk about the score counter here. It's it does the its job instantly. Well here the animation for it's smoother. It seems to be faster to say the least, which is pretty significant. And now I'll be teaching you how to get motion blur for yourself. So go to your web browser. Open up a new tab, and type in reshade. Just reshade. You will find this first result, hdbsreshade.me. Click. Then you will see a download button. Just go here, click, and you will see reshade setup underscore foreign.exe. This is not a virus. A lot of YouTubers use this. Uh, they've got no issues. So yeah, it is a trusted software. So you click, so you open up, and then it should say something different for you. But what you're going to do is you're going to click on this. You will see that you're going to have the different games. What you're going to do is you're going to go on Browse, go to your desktop, click on Roblox Player, open file location, and Roblox Player Beta. Then you're going to press on OpenGL. Now it should say the. Now it would say something different because I already have reshade installed. So just go here. Then it should tell you to install things. Just check every single thing. And you will see that there's going to be something called fake motion blur.fx. You're going to check on that. And then once you open up your game, you're going to have this menu. You're going to skip the tutorial. You're going to press on home button, which is like next, like it's the six keys on top of your arrow keys. You're going to type in motion blur in your uh, search bar. You're going to find motion blur and then adjust it to what you want. Personally, the perfect settings I found were 0 0.6 and 1.3 for uh recall and softness so yeah that's about it hope you enjoyed have a great one